Good morning, we're taking a look at guncalendars.com where we attempt to archive our daily firearms history. However, we don't have every single day filled out. So if you do know something that we're missing from our list or an event that's coming up that we don't already have featured, let us know. Uh, so today is October 22nd and we're taking a look at Jonathan Browning's birthday. So this is John Browning that we're familiar with, probably is his father, Jonathan Browning, who is also a gunsmith. He started out back east, eventually moved to Illinois, where he invented the harmonica gun. I think he actually invented the harmonica gun before he moved to Illinois, but that's where he became a gunsmith and uh, like a big dude in the Mormons. So uh, uh, eventually when the Mormons started getting slaughtered and kicked out of Illinois, uh, they asked him to switch from being a gunsmith to helping people make wagon wheels and other blacksmith type stuff and get them out of Illinois. They moved to uh, Utah, and then he got to uh, making the world's most famous gunsmith. So he has a couple of interesting inventions, the uh, harmonica gun and John Browning. And today is his birthday. That was back in 1805. So October 22nd, 1805 is the uh, birthday of Jonathan Browning, father of John Browning. Yes, it says here he's born in Tennessee. I knew it was somewhere back east. And uh, he produced firearms independently by the time he was uh, 26 years old. Uh, I'm going to take a quick look here over at our gun shop site. And we'll go down to the Jonathan Browning gun shop where uh, we visited this on our visit to the Gun Rights Policy Conference in 2018 in Chicago and uh, visited this in, it's not quite Southern Illinois, it's more like Western Illinois. Um, not, it's a couple hours from Illinois or from Chicago, but uh, it's definitely not near Chicago. But it is on the, literally on the banks of the Mississippi River from the front door here. If you look from that front door behind the picture here, if you look behind, you know, towards the angle where the picture is taken from, uh, you'd see the Mississippi River just a block away. Uh, you could almost swing a rock. You could shoot a bottle rocket into the Mississippi River from his workshop. Uh, on the other side of that river is Iowa, so it's pretty close to Iowa. Uh, but this is um, the recreation the on the foundations of the original workshop in his home. It's pretty neat and uh, has a lot of interesting stuff, so you can check it out. It's completely free. It's an interesting drive through Illinois to get there. And then uh, there's a little town, like a modern town, right outside of this recreation of the olden days town. All that stuff is free, but in the regular town, you know, it's regular, it's in a regular town, so you pay money for things. But you can buy uh, lunch there. I stopped there for lunch. It's a pretty nice little town. So, uh, yeah, if you're ever interested in checking out a very small little gun museum, uh, this is the museum. This little cartoon here shows the museum. This would have been his house. This would have been just more of his house, maybe part of the gun shop. And then this is his gun shop, I think. And it's not very big. It's very uh, small, actually. So there's only about 12 guns there. But you do get to stand on the foundations where Jonathan Browning created uh, some of his, um, probably not his patents, but some of his first guns. And uh, would eventually then move on to Utah and create Jonathan Brown or John Browning. So I guess I did a video on the museum here. Uh, you can check that out over on Gun Shop Guide or check out more uh, interesting information about our firearms history over here on guncalendars.com. If you know anything we're missing, uh, let us know. And if you'd like to continue some of these conversations further, each evening we have a conversation at midnight Eastern. Just a few days from now will be the uh, 2 way rally. It's virtual this year, so everyone can participate. Looking forward to seeing you there. Until next time.